Welcome everyone. Welcome back to some more Danganronpa V3. Oh, hi, uh, Ryoma. Oh, <clears throat> oh boy, gotta get into the voices again. Every time we come back, I'm like, oh right, I have to remember the voices I uh, have been doing, which is uh, terrifying. <clears throat> oh, Suichi. Ah, oh. oh, Ryoma, are you headed to the dining hall? No. Hm. I went there the way I am now. I just ruined the mood. Hey! Listen, I can't ever begin to imagine what your life has been like. And I know that this is gonna sound cliche, but... Okay. You shouldn't give up on life. If you keep living, I'm sure good things will happen. Hm. Huh. Good things, huh? But... Good things are when your wishes, hopes, or dreams are fulfilled, right? What does that have to do with someone like me, with no wishes, hopes, or dreams? Uh, um, but... More importantly... More importantly... Did something happen to you? Huh? Huh? Sheesh. You haven't noticed. You look completely different from yesterday. <laughs> It's like your eyes have stopped focusing on the past. Huh. Your face looks more dependable. Hmm. Ryoma's speech was low and melancholy. He turned and walked away. Uh, okay. Stopped focusing on the past? Well, that's interesting. Alrighty then. Well then, let's get this started. Like I said, it has been a while since I've played, so <laughs> I'm just getting back into the habit of things. Uh -huh. Oh, good morning, Suichi. Hey! Morning, Smoogie. Are you heading to, headed to the dining hall? Yeah! Yeah. Well, not because anyone told me to or anything. I just felt like it. That reminds me. Oh, that reminds me. Have you gone to the casino, Shuichi? I find myself there sometimes. I've never seen most of the games they have there. Could it be? Do you think Monokuma made them? If so, I regret getting hooked on one of them. Hmm. <laughs> You're hooked on one, huh? It's plain to see. I'm just plain confident in my gaming skills. Would you like to play together sometime? Uh, um... uh, sure. Uh, if we get a chance. Uh... Oh, sorry. We should stop talking about stuff like this and go to the dining hall already. I'm gonna go ahead. Huh? Someone's, <laughs> someone's trying to buy control for the ultimate gamer. I'm the only ultimate gamer here. You can't be the ultimate gamer. Oh, someone's right behind me. Oh, hi, Kibo. Kibo. Calm down, Chuichi. It's just Kibo. Uh, good morning, Kibo. Yes. Ah, good morning. Um, have you seen Tokichi or Gunta? Huh? Uh, I haven't seen them. Hmm. I see. I saw them earlier, and they seemed to be sneaking around. As I thought. Given Ko Kokichi's a penchant for mischief. Do you think he's planning to cause more trouble? Gunta is very earnest, but also very naive. Kokichi could easily fool him. Well... That's true. It does sound a bit con disconcerting. Why? I wonder why Kokichi is so determined to undermine our cooperation. True, Monokuma does interfere with our attempts to cooperate, but consider this. Perhaps Monokuma fears more than anything is our cooperation. I... That is why I think that Kaede was not wrong. You're right. Uh, I think so too. I'll always be thankful for what Kaede tried to do for us. Indeed. That's right. If we all cooperate, I'm sure we will be able to escape this place. If we meet every morning for breakfast, we will slowly but surely become more united. Okay. Yeah. Well then. Well then, I will go to the dining hall now. 
I need to get a better voice for Ko Kibo, but honestly, I'm not very good at robot voices. All oh, right, there's a run button. Uh, it's that one. <laughs> I tried every other shoulder button first. <clears throat> hey. Uh, good morning, Tenko. Yes. Good morning, Shuichi. Hirumi made us breakfast this morning too. You're right. You're right. It smells good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I wonder what hot pot she'll make this morning. Boar hot pot, or maybe pheasant hot pot. Everything Kurumi cooks tastes delicious. I'm so excited. Alrighty. So it's going to be hot pot. So it's going to be hot pot, huh? What is it? Oh, what is going on with Tenko's diet? There. I mean, hot pot is good. It's delicious, but... Having it for every meal seems a little... Especially for breakfast, seems a little dense. Well, hello, everyone. Hmm. According to my calculations, not everyone has gathered today. I suppose so. You can you can see that without doing any calculations. Jeez. Jeez. What's going on with everyone else? It seems as if It seems Maki has chosen to spend all the time in her ultimate research lab. Not sure what she's doing in there, but she has no intention of leaving. What was that? What does the ultimate child caregiver got to do with her in a research lab anyway? Maybe she's hiding a bunch of kids in there that she's secretly taking care of? Uh, um... Uh, what? She's not some stray dog on the street raising pups. Um... I also saw Kokichi and Gunta sneaking around together. Ah. A couple of virgins sneaking around sounds like bad news to me. Hey! Hey, uh, I saw Ryoma on, on my way here, but he said he wasn't coming today. Hmm. I see. Uh, we don't need that guy around here till he's got his head on straight. <laughs> How the famous Ryoma Hoshi end up like that? What? The famous Ryoma Hiroshi. Uh, moving along. What are those two doing? What is that? Uh, um. Oh God! What are they doing? <laughs> These two make me nervous. Um. Uh, hey, what are you guys doing? Prayer time! Praying to Atua, of course. Hmm. Oh no! <laughs> Ang. Oh, gotta get Himiko's voice back. Ahem. <clears throat> Praying to Atua. Huh? And that's not it. Huh? You too, Himiko! Mm. Eh. As long as I pray like this, I don't need to waste my energy on useless stuff. No matter what happens or what trouble lies ahead, my heart will be calm. I'll commit that to my memory bank. I see. It's escapism. That's not right! No. She merely has... Uh, she has merely abandoned reality to speak to Atua. Actually... That... <laughs> that is escapism. Oh my! Really? I did not know that. You gotta be kidding me! Hey Angie, when did you brainwash Himiko? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> On the contrary, I have undone her brainwashing. Hmm. Hmm. Eh. I was brainwashed before, back when I didn't feel the presence of Atua. <laughs> <laughs> it seems it's too late. Himiko! Himiko, please get a hold of yourself. You have to face reality. Hey, Himiko! Himiko! Stop it. Stop it. When you interrupt me, it messes up my calm heart. I, I remember this nightmare reality I'm in. All of my insecurities and loneliness. That, the pain that, that, that made me want to die. Here! Jeez, Tenko. Don't interrupt Himiko while she's playing, pray. Then, smiling as always, Angie walked up to Himiko and... Mm, mm. uh, I understand, Himiko. You're not actually scared. You're just sad, aren't you? You feel frustrated, anxious, and worried, but 
You have no one to confide in, do you? It's okay. You're not alone, Himiko. I know a handsome god who is keeping a watchful eye on you. Uh, handsome god? Ah! Eh, what a mysterious miracle. Not scared anymore. Thanks, Bituatua. Ah, how wonderful. It is all thanks to the hands that handsome god. Hey! Hey! What handsome god? Wait, Himiko, you like handsome men? Why can't it be me? You. Are you playing for the other team? Uh huh? Uh -huh. What are you talking about? It's nothing like that. Hey! Angie, what did you do to Himiko? Huh? Huh? What did I do? What a surprise! I did something? No. I did something? I did? What did I do? Yeah, yeah. Ah, yes, yes. Atua has spoken to me. I shall convey his message to everyone. Huh? Huh? Where is this conversation going? Anyway, what was Atua's message? It concerns me a little. This has just gotten weirder and weirder today. Hey! At Anji. Or, yeah, Anji. What are these divine messages? Uh... Atua says that this academy suffers from the same sins as the outside world. You're all unhappy because your greed is making you treat each other like our adversaries. Atua has spoken. Atua has spoken. Your desire to leave this place is only worsening your greed. Uh, um... Greed? Cause Atua says so! So we must cast aside that sinful greed and rejoice in our new lives here. <sighs> so, you are saying we should live here for the rest of our lives? No, no. No, no. That's wrong. How divine! It's not enough to simply live here forever. Our lives must also be full of divine purpose. In other words, you see? we must make this academy heaven on earth. What? And then? In doing so, our desire to leave will vanish, and the killings will cease. That's... Are you being serious right now? Because... This place provides us all with shelter, food, clothing, and wonderful friends. You'll get punished. What more could you possibly desire? Do not give in to your greed. What? That was ominous. What? Himiko! Himiko, do you hear your nonsense? Hear this nonsense? Snap out of it! Cut it out! Atua's divine messages are never wrong. Huh? What? Uh, yep. Himiko is a good girl and a fast learner. And then? Together we devised a truly divine plan. <laughs> the best plan ever to help us live lives of fulfillment here. Huh? The best plan. Here. Tell them, Himiko. Everyone! Make them burst with happiness. Uh. Uh, explode with excitement. It's finally happening. Great, huh? The amazing Himiko's magic show is finally opening. Huh? A magic show? <laughs> Don't worry, admission is free. Uh, actually, I guess admission will just be your smiles. Over the years, my show has given uh, many smiles to people with broken hearts. Now's the time to demonstrate my powers. With my magic. My magic is the only thing that can heal your twisted hearts. Hmm. But our current predicament, performing magic tricks, is quite illogical. Stop it. Yeah. Don't disturb my concentration. You gotta learn to read the mood already. And it's called Magic Show because I do magic, not tricks. <laughs> Screw your Magic Show! I don't get excited about that crap. Wait, why? You're way too excited. How about that? Eh. The show opens tomorrow morning. Come to the gym after the morning announcement. You guys better get excited and look forward to it with it, with, and that anticipation. 
say? Surely you mean anticipation? Or have I misunderstood the nature of this show? Well then. Himiko and I will begin the prep work. And I'm supposed to ask others to help too. Sayonara. I'm counting on you guys to help. <laughs> Sayonara. Mm. Yeah. Farewell. I didn't like that farewell. That seemed ominous as well, as everything else has today. After announcing their uh, show before anyone could react, Himiko and Angie left the uh, dining hall. Himiko? Himiko! Uh, what happened to her? Oh dear. <laughs> Faith has intense. Faith as intense as this can be quite terrifying. But... There may be no concern, no cause for concern. This does not appear to be related to our motive videos. Come on, man. You're only worried about that. I'm worried. Of course. We cannot afford to take Monokuma's motives lightly. But... But... Everyone who isn't here could be showing each other their videos, right? The fuck you just say? You mean Kokichi Gun... No. <laughs> You mean Kokichi, Gunta, and Ryoma? No. No, I don't think that's it. Even with three people, that's a low probability of them having each other's motive videos. Seems unlikely that one of them would show a motive video without seeing their own return. So I don't think a video exchange in a small group like that is likely. True. I see. That is true. Well done! <laughs> Not bad. That's the ultimate detective for you. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Um. I get. Ooh. <laughs> I. I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. The same goes for Angie and Himiko. Ah! Uh, give, give Himiko back. What do you think? Well, now let us have some breakfast, shall we? I have prepared meals for everyone. Of course, I will deliver meals to those who are not currently present. Ah. Uh, you don't gotta do that. I'll eat their portions. Ah! Okay. <laughs> Kaito, uh, don't push yourself too hard. <laughs> you're gonna give your, you're gonna shit yourself. <clears throat> After I helped the stuffed Kaito to his room, I returned to my own room. The stuffed Kaito. <laughs> uh, Kokichi and Gunta. Angie and Himiko. And Ryoma. And Maki too. Everyone's all over the place. But I shouldn't just leave them be. There's a lo There has to be something I can do. Yes, I'm going to do something about this. I doubt I can hang out with Himiko. Which makes me worried that something's going to happen to Himiko, or she's going to do something. Since she has been brainwashed by Angie. And Angie... I'm getting bad vibes off of Angie now. So... That's not great. That's not what I wanted. I keep forgetting it's not start to open up the menu, it's X. Which is weird. Um... Uh, so yeah, I guess we'll just... Oops. I guess we'll just look at the map and see who I can find. The Mew. Tenko. Well, I can go try and talk to her. She is in the gym. So, let's try, but I... <clears throat> I doubt she's going to be in a very talkative mood. Oh, I should probably go through my items even and figure out what I have. Also, is that Tenko spying on them? Because, I mean, that sounds like a thing that she would do. Um, I don't have any of those, which we know she likes. Um, I think one of the last things I gave her was sugar or bird. I can't remember if I gave her bird food or not. Uh, 
was there. So I guess we'd have to just give her something sweet. I know I already gave her ginger tea because one time when I talked to her she was mentioning that she liked tea. So. Um... Maybe just a candy cigarette? Because sugar? I, we know that she likes sugar. She likes sweet things. This is probably good for everyone. And I have a lot of them, so maybe I should give her one of those. Give it a shot. I'm not even gonna talk to Tenko. Um, staff access only, you say? Hmm. Uh, what is this? There's a small talisman posted on the gym door that- on the door that leads to the gym. That's right. They did say they were doing a ma- that the magic show would be in the gym. I guess no one is allowed to enter while they're setting up. That's sketchy as fuck in a murder game! Someone's gonna be dead behind that door! Just need to figure out if it's going to be Anji or... Uh, Himika. I have a bad feeling that Angie is going to uh, make like a sacrifice to Atua using Himika. That is, I'm calling that right now. That's probably not going to be the case. I hope that's not the case. That would be pretty sad. Um, I guess we'll go talk to Miu. Uh, actually, I should check. I was checking items for, um... Or now I, uh, Himika, now I need to look up for Miu. I don't know what she would like though. I guess technology based things or lewd shit. But I don't know if I have either. Well, I probably have technology based shit. Like, um. I mean, she'll probably like the tentacle machine. That sounds. That sounds about right. Um. Cosmic blanket? Well, we know who wants cosmic shit. Um... Maybe she would like the laser gun? We could try that. Wait, what'd that say? That had a weird description that I read. A replica laser used by upstanding citizens to punish rebellious and unhappy people. When carrying this around, be sure to watch your coefficient. Oh, it's that laser gun! Oh, what's that show called? Um... Crap. Oh, I remember that show. Oh, I don't remember what it's called, though. Yeah, I, I, I know what they're talking about now. Maybe she was like the Ernest Compass. Okay, there's a few things I can think of to give her. Maybe we'll start with the onyx, uh, the cufflinks, because those are, like, good for everyone, it sounds like. Uh, where the hell is she, though? I assume she's in the casino? Because we can't, we couldn't get in the Kama Sutra, uh, place. That took a little while to load. I still love this jazz and music. I need to, uh, where's the music up here? Is it up to the left or up to the right? Up to the left. Donga Vegas. Okay, okay, that's a good name. I have to remember that. So I can look that up. Huh? <laughs> and no, there'd be no way. Why can't I get Mew right? There's no way I'd be- I'd ever be excited to see a magic show. Watching a little run perform on stage will be- will for sure bore the shit out of me. Still looks and uh, kind of excited though. Should I hang around with me? Sure. Like I said, it doesn't excite me. 
I just want to watch it so I can get it over with. Man, my Mew voice is gone. I spent some time with Mew who was fidgeting constantly, eager for the show. I somehow ended up uh, growing closer to Mew. Somehow. Uh, let's give her this. What? Huh? What's this? I mean, I guess I'll take it. This is what you're get. This is. Oh, okay. I, I that last part of the sentence I kept mixing up in my head. This is what you're given to my lovely self. I figured you'd. Uh, I figured you for a piece of shit, but. Ah, didn't actually get closer. That sucks. I guess it's that item isn't as good as I thought it was. Oh well. There's still some time left. Oh boy. This is either gonna be Kokichi or Ryoma. Huh? Yes. Hmm. I guess that's Kaito, but is he here to train already? We weren't supposed to train in uh to train weren't we supposed to train at late uh night? He's a little early. Then the moment I open the door. Oh, hey. Chuichi, run! Huh? Huh? What happened? Damn! Don't just stand there. Hurry, he's coming! What happened? Who's coming? What? Uh, Kaito risked a glance down the hallway and immediately stiffened up in fear. <laughs> Damn it! He's already here. Hurry, Chuichi, run! Chuichi! If we both make it out of this alive, let's train again. Ah! Uh, uh, Kaito? Kaito gave his ominous warning and then ran away at lightning speed. Huh? What? What are you talking about? I peeked through the gap in the doorway to discover what Kaito was so terrified by. Huh? Um... That's Gunta, isn't it? He looks different. What's going on? It looks like he's checking each room. He'll be at my door soon. I don't know what he's up to, but it's probably better not to be here. Carefully to avoid alerting Gunta, I quietly tiptoed down the hall. I stealthily made my way to the courtyard. Well then. That was not what I was expecting. What was that all about? What was Gunta up to? Yeah. Ugh. From the looks of it, you ran away from Gunta too? Ah, uh, Ryoma. What now? I don't know why, but it seems like he's gone into a rage and he's trying to catch everyone. <laughs> he's charging right at me at top speed. Huh? He threw himself right at you, but you managed to get away? That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I used this Tsukuchi method. Technique from my tennis days. Like a flash step, you know? Of course. I've gotten rusty since back in my day. But... You've still got a ways to go. Gunther's still got a ways to go. You won't be able to catch me like that. Tsukuchi... Yoma must have been an incredible player in the day. By Back the in the day. By the way, I'm sorry. For saying something so uncool like, I've got no reason to live. Huh? No, you don't have to apologize. However, I'm going to say this so we're clear. I'm not so stupid to, that I'd waste my life. I... Uh, I only said something like that. Because I was jealous of you. Why? Jealous? Yeah. If I had a stronger attachment to life, I would be trying my best alongside you all. Hmm? Hmm? Suddenly, Ryoma ducked down and taking cover. When I looked uh, to find what had scared Ryoma, I saw... There you are. Hey, where are you going? Huh? Gota? Sorry, Shuichi, but I'm gonna run. I've still got things I need to do. No! Gonta no can let you leave. 
Sorry, but is for your own good. Gunta charged at us like a runaway train, and then I lost consciousness. <laughs>